illnesses got the chance to hop on a plane to the North Pole. This is always such a special story every year. The Now Detroit Simon Chowdhury is live to tell us about their fantasy flight to visit Santa. Simon. That's right, guys. It may look like a winter wonderland out here, but how cool would it be to get on a plane and go ahead to the North Pole to meet Santa? Well, that's exactly what more than 70 kids with severe and terminal illnesses got to do today. Now, some has co had come as far as Lansing. They went to Detroit Metro Airport to get on the flight. They were greeted with music and other fun festivities. Now, the group Silver Liners hosted the 32nd annual event. Each year, that group of retired flight attendants helped take the children to the North Pole to meet Santa Claus on a Delta flight. The plane taxied on the runway with the engines roaring to simulate a short flight. Now, the event brings smiles on all their faces, not just the kids, but the parents and volunteers, too. I think this is a fantastic program for kids. Um, she's been through a lot this year. She was diagnosed with Crohn's disease last January, and um, through the result of that, she's had heart failure and kidney failure. So we've had a really rough year, so this, um, this opportunity is pretty awesome for her. Oh, I think it's a great, the, the event, you mean? All together, it's amazing. I think they've made it so magical for the kids and the parents. I'm having a great time. I know my son is. Everything's just, wow, they're going above and beyond. It's really great, yeah. And organizers say that once they got off the plane, they got a chance to meet the elves and Santa. And they say this was their biggest flight, largest flight this year with 77 kids. And, you know, you guys, I got an exclusive off camera interview with Santa. Mm. And uh, he said he had a ton of fun meeting these children and he looks forward to doing this every year. I'll send it back to you. I bet. What a special day, Simon. Thank you. Yeah.